Hello, I'm Jeff Lindsay. I'm a technician and supervisor here at the Waste Management Facility here on campus. I just want to take you for a quick rock, walk around and uh, let you learn a little bit about what we do here every day. So, uh, you may see us out on campus. Um, every week we come out and pick up all the chemical, biological, and radioactive waste on campus. That's our specialty here. Um, I'll take you around and show you uh, some of the beginnings and endings of our waste that many of you produce in research, teaching, and operations every day. Uh, we have a lot of different rooms like this. We, we categorize each chemical by um, hazard. So um, many of our wastes uh, are come in uh, from, from campus uh, and are segregated into these drums. Um, for example, this um, lab pack, and that's a specialty term in the industry, um, is used for our high hazard and our solid chemicals. Uh, this allows us to ship these chemicals for uh, appropriate disposal based on environmental standards and regulatories in both federally and provincially. Much of our waste also comes in in liquid form. Uh, this is one of the easiest waste to deal with, but also one of the most hazardous. I'll take you down to our flammable room. This is our flammable room in the most dangerous spot uh, of work here at the waste management facility. Uh, we, we manually handle all our liquid waste that often comes in in these 4 liter, 10 liter and 20 liter containers. There's, the chemicals are segregated by class, uh, whether they're halogenated, flammable, toxic, those sort of categori categorization. Um, and, and that way the technicians here can segregate and bulk these chemicals for final disposal. This allows uh, for a more economical uh, disposal option as well as uh, is, is within the industry standard. After bulking, lab packing, or general processing of the compounds here, uh, I'll take you and show you the final disposal point for us here. So this is our barrel storage room. This happens to be the starting and the end point for everything that comes to us here at the waste management facility. When, when the technicians are out on campus, they bring everything here, we can sort it by category and move out to those rooms I just showed you for further packing and processing. Uh, the final resting point at our end of things is these barrels and, and we produce uh, over 500 drums on average every year of solid and liquid waste. From here, um, further processing uh, contractors uh, come up and pick our waste to go to a larger scale disposal facility that meets regulatory standards for the industry. Thank you.